My name's Ollie, and this video is guaranteed to make your life that little bit better. Welcome to the world of pint size. Today, from the Little Beer Corporation in Guildford in Surrey, we're drinking a limited edition version of their Little Slow. The Little Beer Corporation is a microbrewery based in Surrey that believes in acting little, and they want their consumers to do the same. To do this, there are a few simple steps. So here we go, the Little Beer Corporation's guide to how to act little. Cherish where you live. Be human. Be humble. Be understated. Be honest. Be creative. Live a life that is fulfilling. They want you to do what your heart and soul truly want you to do. Whether it's ditch your city job and become a violinist, pursue the insanely great, go and renovate a house in Italy, or for me, at this very moment in time, drink their beer. Here's a bottle of the Little Slow. You can see it here, it's a lovely designed bottle actually. It's really great. Um, yeah, it's just a nice, cool little branding. I love their little logo. And yeah, this is the limited edition, green hopped with Farnham hops. It's supposedly a deep honey-coloured Pilsner Lager that's slow fermented, sharply snappy with a little bit of a focus on hot bitterness, a soft bready centre and a very dry finish. That just sounds, a, what a great combination of flavour and words, descriptions. As I said, this one is limited edition. It's been green hopped with Farnham hops and it's only available once a year. We managed to get our hands on this limited edition brilliant beer. Thanks to our friends at ebrea.com where you can get the best of British beer straight from the people that made it. Little slow, pouring in the glass, little slow. Look at your ass. It's a lovely colour, it's really, really carbonated. It's got this lovely, nice, thick, white head. It smells epic. It's actually a really sweet smell that you would expect from a Pilsner. It's a little bit sweeter than, uh, than I'm used to smelling. Ah, oh. ah, oh. that ladies and gents, is epic. It's got a really nice honey sweetness that you don't usually get from Pilsners. Uh, you, can, you can tell that it's this limited edition green hopped because there's, there's just an explosion of hops. There's a really, really cool, uh, cool addition to this lager. It's quite a cool combo, really. This, the like, sort of honey, caramel sweetness and the hops kind of combine and make it maybe a little bit piney. Uh, a bit apple -y. it's just great. What a, ah! Oh, I wouldn't even leave, uh, but, <laughs> I think that may be the best craft beer pilsner I've ever had. That's enough about the beer, it's time to learn something new. Wikipedia has offered pint size today, George Duvivier, Burnaby, New Westminster, David Redzepi, the, the, what? The, <coughs> the 24th Gold Bag Awards, 12, th <laughs> 12 38, in Norway. I really want to go for the 24th Gold Bag Awards, but the Wikipedia page for 1238 in Norway is outstanding. So let's go through some of the major events that happened in Norway in the year 1238. Major events, we've got none. Good, okay, well done. Uh, arts and literature, none either. Significant deaths, no. No one, no. And significant births. No one. That's right, King of Norway, Magnus the Lawmender the Sick of Norway was born in 1238. Apparently the only significant thing that happened in Norway that whole year. The best thing I can find about Magnus the Sixth of Norway was that in 1261 he married the daughter of late Danish king, whose name I definitely won't be able to remember without looking at my screen. Eric Plogpenning. Eric Plogpenning. Magnus was remembered as a good ruler who ruled with the law and not the sword. Good lad. Awful crest. Awful crest. That's all for today. Remember to like us on Facebook and subscribe if you like what you saw and help us try to get to 1,000 as soon as we possibly can. Final word on the Little Slow Limited Edition by the Little Beer Corporation. One of the best craft pilsners I've ever had. Just brilliant. 
hand craft every one of their beers. They also make these really cool bottles. Little dingus, little label there. Yeah! 